guys welcome to DIY with Jojo so in today's episode I'll be showing you how I upcycle some of the coasters that I did get for my thrift haul so if you have not watched the thrift haul video I'll leave a link in the cards above and in the description box below so make sure to check it out so when I did get the coasters I had a gut coasters in mind but the thing with Agat Costas, they're made using resin and resin is not locally available. So I thought maybe I could use the Costas and make something that would resemble the Agat Costas. So in this video, I'll show you how I did make my four Agat Costas. If that is something that you'd like to watch, keep watching. First, I left the images that you'd like to use. So I went on Google and searched for Agat Costas. And uh, images go to tools. Then select size, and a size choose larger than 1024 by 768. So this ensures that your images are large enough and they will not be pixelated in case you want to manipulate them. Select images that are upright and they are facing you, so this makes it easy for you to manipulate them. So what you'll need is your glossy paper, which you'll have printed your image of choice, and then you'll need Mod Podge, which you can get from Mira's Craft, it's a shop located at Salt Center, and then you'll need your foam brush to apply the glue, and then of course, you need your coasters. So I do want my image to pass the border of the coaster, so I make sure that it's like less than a centimeter, less than an inch in you'll overturn your paper and then apply glue on your brush and apply it evenly a thin coat will do So after you're done, apply another coat on top and this will act as a sealant. So we'll do the first layer and then we'll wait for 15 to 20 minutes for it to dry. And then we'll come back and do another coat. So after 15 minutes, come back and do as the second layer and uh, don't be worried since the glue is appearing opaque, when it dries, it will be clear. I want the sides to be gold. So what you'll do is, and I don't want to be straight, I want it to be rugged, just like the agate coasters. So what you'll do, you'll take a foil paper, just cut a small piece, I think this is even too much. And then make, make a small bowl out of it. So this is why you're going to spray paint. The thing with spray paint, if you do it uh, close enough to the surface, it will start dripping. It will be watery. And then you lose a brush, a painting brush, to apply the paint around the edges. So, shake your can as you go. So take your spray and apply it on the edges. This is the reason why I did not want to print the paper all the way to the edge so that I could paint 
the edges So this is the reason why I love spray paint because you can virtually use this from anything in your house. So, so far, I like how it's coming along. So, that's my coaster. I'll wait for it to dry and then I'll give it another coat and then seal it to the mud porch. Dried up, you come back, do another layer of the mud pot, and then seal even the edges. watching today's episode so let me know down in the comment section below what you think of today's DIY and if you did like the video give it a thumbs up share it with your friends and if you're new what are you waiting for hit the subscribe button below until next time bye